And good afternoon, Trinidad and Tobago. I'm Stacey Ann Providence, and this is your CNews update. A St. Joseph man is charged with the murder of Jamaica national Kalik Blake. Andrew Michael Kevin Felix appeared before Chief Magistrate Marcia A. Caesar in the Port of Spain 8th Magistrate's Court. Mr. Blake, 30 years old, died at the Port of Spain Hospital after being admitted on January 23rd, suffering from multiple stab wounds. The victim was transported by ambulance to the hospital from a Woodbrook guest house where he was found at around 11.55 p.m. Felix, who is 21 years old of Agostini Street, Elizabeth Garden, St. Joseph, was remanded in custody to reappear on March 16th. He was charged by woman sergeant Sheldine Bacchus of the Homicide Bureau of Investigations, Region 1, following instructions from the Director of Public Prosecutions, Senior Counsel Roger Gaspard. The driver who caused the deaths of Carla Collins and her th two children has been charged. 28-year-old Kelvin Lewis appeared before Arima Magistrate Julia Davis, Scotland, and was charged with three counts of causing death, one charge of using the priority bus route without authorization, and one charge of drunk driving. He pleaded guilty of the two lesser charges, but was not called upon to plead for the three charges of causing death as they were laid indictably. He was granted bail of $350,000 and was also called to give up his passport and driver's permit. An Adashin farmer is killed. He has been identified as 33-year-old Kimdeo Jawahiu. He was killed while returning home with his father-in-law from planting crops in Bish. Jawahiu's stepfather heard that a masked man jumped out of the forested area on Makano Road and shot the man in the neck. Jawahiu's wife is five months pregnant with their first child. Police are investigating. Well, that was your seniors update. I'm Stacey Ann Providence. Do have a good afternoon. <laughs>